It's, um, it's most amazing to be living a life where to have, to have access to the solution to all problems in, in a short moment of open intelligence, in resting mind and body completely and recognizing and acknowledging the fundamental intelligence, beneficial intelligence that's at the basis of everything that we experience open intelligence, shining brightly. No matter what the content of our experience is, no matter what the data streams are that are streaming, we, we can rest completely right now and allow the current data stream just to be as it is. And to introduce ourselves most directly to open intelligence, this beneficial intelligence that pervades everything and is always available, we simply stop thinking for a moment and notice what remains. Space like openness, clarity, alertness, always on, always on, always on, always present, never going anywhere, never went anywhere, never will. Open intelligence. And uh, we can see that the the data that stream, the data streams, they're forever changing. And we can also describe them in many ways. Descriptions also are data streams. And we can see that the data streams are inseparable from open intelligence. We only know our experience through our power to know, through open intelligence. They're inseparable like the breeze in the air. The data streams appearing in open intelligence like a rainbow in space completely pervaded by open intelligence, having no independent nature. And um, what we get to know through the Balance View training and the opportunity we have in short moments of open intelligence repeated many times is for open intelligence to become obvious. And in short moments to simply allow the current data stream just to be as it is. You can test it right now, no matter what you're thinking, feeling, uh, emoting, experiencing, whatever the current data stream is. Maybe, it, maybe it's physical pain. Maybe it's the social awkwardness coming back. We never know when that's going to pop up. And, and there's a perfect opportunity just to rest naturally, rest naturally, rest openly in the completeness of your being as you are, in open intelligence. Vast, inexhaustible, spacious intelligence. The data streams we see, they resolve moment by moment, <coughs> leaving no trace, even, even, even physical pain. <clears throat> you know, like having a, having a pain and then, and then thinking about dinner and then, and then thinking about the pain and then the, where does the attention go? Where did that pain go? It's resolving back into open intelligence. <clears throat> it doesn't mean that the, we, we might not, it might not come back even very quickly, but it's still resolving. And, um, and that's a very powerful insight to see, to see the nature and the primary nature of open intelligence. What knows the pain? What knows the social awkwardness? What is at the basis of it? What is primary to it? Go there, rest there at the root of it all. It doesn't mean getting rid of. So that's really good to see. That's really powerful to see that we don't need to change our data streams. We don't need to change how we feel in order to recognize open intelligence. It's simultaneous. The data streams actually help. <laughs> they help. They help us to remember to relax, especially the negative ones, the ones we've always labeled as negative and wrong. For me, that was very clear. Things that I didn't want to have, it was much nicer to relax like especially physical pain and um, and even though it wasn't what I had learnt in terms of social awkwardness, social awkwardness was definitely an opportunity to um, well run away mainly. <laughs> it was like so I, I'm something's wrong with me or something's wrong with someone else or something's wrong with this situation due to this feeling coming up. That was the entire story that would be built and I need to change something, normally remove myself from that situation or avoid someone 
um, avoid certain settings. So it kept life, you know, like to a certain to a certain limited track, you could say, or specific tracks of like how I would place myself in order to constantly have these feelings of I'm okay, that I would label as I'm okay. Certain data streams, like, you know, feeling, feeling perky, <laughs> feeling, feeling sociable, whatever that would entail, like feeling on, I'm having a good day so I can connect with everyone. Yeah, yeah, like that person. Oh no, don't like that person quickly we're going to go the other way or they made me feel socially awkward let's get out of here and um and so really you can just see in that simple example like what what that entails in life how being completely at the whim of the thoughts and emotions thinking that that's what that's the entirety of my experience in that moment and I collapse into that data stream and have to change it so with short moments of open intelligence we have another opportunity we we remain completely open we rely on what's at the basis of that data stream right now right now it's always our opportunity in this moment to take a short moment of open intelligence Simply rest mind and body, complete relaxation. Relax into everything as it is. And this happens on the fly, quickly. It, it, it's not an extended practice. I mean, you, you can if you want, you can just sit and like <laughs> deeply relax as much as you like. That's also brilliant. But what's amazing about the practice of short moments is it is, it's just, you know, spontaneous freestyling benefit. It's getting down with what is real moment by moment, really seeing that these data streams that have seemed so real and so influencing are pure like space and pervaded by open intelligence and hold no power of their own. We, we get to see what's really going on. It's so thrilling. It's so thrilling. It's so thrilling to feel socially awkward. <laughs> it's the best. It's like, ah, you know, it's raging. And it feels like a radical social act. A radical social act of benefit to not act on it, to not go there, to not do what's always been done in my experience. You know, collapse into it, make myself small, make myself a victim of it, or make others a victim of it, of my, my influence. You know, like taking responsibility, fully taking responsibility for my power, my vast power as open intelligence, not limited to a data dot, a definition of who I think I take myself to be in that moment. Blowing it wide open in a short moment of open intelligence, seeing what's really going on, raging with social anxiety, raging with the power of the universe and connecting right there with anyone that I want to. God damn it. <laughs> That's what's best. It's like, I will not be influenced by this. No, I will remain open. I will remain open. I don't want to live like that. So take that into any data stream. And that's our power in every single moment in, as open intelligence to see the benefit of all and how we wish to act and enact it. No limit, no limitation. And the importance of practicing and being supported in our practice of short moments to train up this beneficial seeing and capacity to be of benefit. You know, it's, it's so needed to, to not be at the whim of our data streams. We see what's going on in the world where, where jealousy, anger, hatred, rage, and people believe it and act it out, take it to the extreme. So we see through it for the benefit of all. It starts with each of us, every single human being taking that responsibility. And so this is the purpose of Balanced View is for everyone to see their power moment by moment, to see we're not limited by the flow of our data streams in any way, and actually they are the dynamic beneficial power of our intelligence, that alone. The descriptions we give them, that's up to us. So moment by moment, rest wide open as open intelligence. Direct perception, complete perceptual openness, and see for yourself what's really going on. See how it is when you feel very socially awkward and you let it be as it is. You just let it be as it is. And it doesn't always seem easy at the beginning. It just doesn't, it's not, you know, it's not what I had been trained in. It's not what I had learned. Um, and 
And so that's where the, the empowerment network of the four mainstays is just so essential. It's so essential. It, it's, um, it makes it so easy. It makes it so simple. You know, every time I pick up the four mainstays, so to speak, every time I engage with the four mainstays, so that includes, so that, that's the short moments of open intelligence, which are just always there, always available in the back pocket. You can just rest mind and body. I mean, it's the best. So, doo -doo. And um, <laughs> I don't always make that face or noise. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that will become like a really like world famous jingle. Like, what's the other ones in those companies? And um, <laughs> I'll patent it now. Um, <laughs> and um, you can just any moment just choose to acknowledge your greatest power, open intelligence, simultaneous to the data stream. Empower yourself. Empower yourself for the benefit of all. And then to support us in our short moments. There's the training and training media. Just constantly confirm, constantly confirming our capacity, <laughs> our, our identity as open intelligence, our capacity to rest as it, and our beneficial power. And a trainer, equally the same, even more, reaching further, opening more, the relationship with the trainer, another human being, a glorious relationship, like, world changing amazing <laughs> i think you more brilliant adjectives i can say but it's just it's magical magical to have a relationship with another human being which is completely rooted in empowerment and and your capacity to be of benefit to all that's it nothing else going on and every time you turn to that relationship and open to it it, it reveals more gems more gems revealed to you like, there's no limit, however far you want to take it. And, um, and you know, it's much ordinary, extraordinary. Not a relationship I had had before, at the same time empowers all my relationships in such an amazing way. And, um, and then the community. You know, for me, I was very fortunate. I still am. Um, <laughs> but I... I Lived in, I live in Bristol and um, I met the training in Bristol and the community grew around me, <laughs> and, um, which was an incredible blessing and um, meant that in my daily walk of my life, you know, even at times when very early on I wasn't even going to meetings, I was meeting people relying on open intelligence in the street. <laughs> and it was, you know, like the de it was obvious, it was obvious. And, and it was the, the, it was so magnetizing as well. And simply to be with people who are relying on open intelligence and allowing data students to be as they are, it, it, it just serves us so profoundly. And I just saw how much it served me to be of benefit. And that's, that's what was so incredible, how I could then be a benefit to myself and everyone in my life through the community, through the trainer, through the training, through the short moments. And that is just like so exciting. And, um, you know, of course, we, we all have different lifestyles and, and, you know, places we will be. And I've also just seen my own experiences best, like what serves me, what supports me and going for that basically, really going for that. And, um, but even if we are away from community, we do, have, we do have the downloads, we have contact with our trainer. There is always internet <laughs> somewhere nowadays, which is amazing. And, um, but I just saw how profoundly supported I was, you know, whenever returning to be with community face to face. But there are always times when we are away and they are enriching, enriching and deepening in an amazing way. You know, short moments come into their own and we just see the rest of the four mainstays like come alive and how they can support us and our recognition. So there's really no going wrong, which is amazing. So that helps us in more complete relaxation. Open intelligence is on. It is our nature. It's already the case. We, we can just recognize it. We acknowledge it. We, we choose to train it up and make it obvious. And it's a, an effortless way with the four mainstays, it's, it's completely effortless. Just 
complete relaxation into the Four Mainstays, allowing, allowing ourselves to flourish totally. All, all dark corners, all corners we've ever thought were dark, illuminated with bright benefit, because that's all that's going on. <laughs>